Hello, I'm Dr Alexander Jackson and I'm a curator at the National Football Museum and I'm here to talk to you about football beyond the war. Christmas is often seen as a time of charity and giving. In this, the centenary year of the end of the First World War, we've been looking at a charity that tried to help footballers after the First World War. Manchester City Secretary Manager Ernest Madnell had the idea to create a fund to help the families of those who've been killed in the war or players who've been maimed in it. It was decided to give each beneficiary a five pound Christmas present, including children under five. In December 1917, the Football National War Fund was created. The Football Association and the Football League both contributed money and more was raised by the playing of charity football matches. In 1920, over 6,000 pounds was being paid out. One of the recipients of these gifts was one of Ernest Magnell's own Manchester City players. In 1918, Peter Gartland was a promising young defender serving with the Royal Field Artillery in France. He was wounded and shortly after the armistice, the club received a letter from him describing what had happened to him. I was very unlucky to lose my leg as my wound was just the size of a three penny piece. I sat down and bandaged myself up and I was in hospital within two hours of being hit. I was not in hospital for more than 10 minutes before they had my leg off, as it happened to be a gas shell and the gas was working right up my leg. But I'm doing fine now and I'm sorry to say that I finished with the game my heart and soul were in. Between 1920 and 1921, Peter received 65 pounds from the fund. In 1937, when the fund was finally closed down, Peter received one of the final Christmas gifts of five pounds.